Before you close your eyes, I want you to pick a buddy for tonight, okay? So we've got this little bud. And this little buddy. So whichever one you want, that'll be the little buddy that snuggles up next to you while you work your way to sleep. Sleep, 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 sleep. Okay. Have you decided? Okay, good. I'm going to bring you closer, just a little closer, just a little closer. Okay. Now, I'm going to count down from three, and when I get to one, I want you to close your eyes. Okay? Here we go. Three, and no sooner. Two, one. Close your eyes. Close, close, close. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Good. 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 Now, I want you to feel the ground or the bed or whatever beneath you and remember that it is holding you up and you don't have to work to hold yourself up you can just melt all right so imagine you just let yourself melt no pressure to release all that fucking tension it's fine if you can't do that i understand <laughs> so just allow yourself to melt just a little bit more just a little bit more. Perfect. Okay. Now I want you to tell me when you start to hear the little clink, 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 clinking of the little plastic slug. You'll know when you hear it if you've not heard it before. Okay? Tell me when you hear it. Here. Tell me when you hear it start coming closer. Good. 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 Tell me when you hear it go far away. Good job. Now, I want you to pick scratching or tapping. Your choice. It doesn't really matter. It is not a huge detrimental choice. All right. Have you picked? Cool. All right. So, whichever one you picked, I want you to tell me when you hear it. So when you hear it, I want you to go now. Okay. Obviously, that can be in your head. You don't have to say anything out loud. You just chill. You just melt. All right, here we go. Good. You're doing great. You're doing so good. Very good. Now, I want you to, every time you hear this, that sort of swooshing around sound, I want you to imagine if you can't see it, if your eyes are closed, as they should be, it is a beach ball with glitter inside. I want you to imagine that the glitter is washing over you and just cleaning you out of anything bad that happened today. If that means that you want to think about the thing that happened and feel like it's washing you clean, 
that's fine if you don't want to think about it and you would rather just have the glitter do its job then that's fine as well so whenever you hear this sound throughout the video just imagine that it's cleaning 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 cleaning, cleaning anything bad off of you okay all right in the meantime i want you to tell me when you hear the tapping versus when you hear the squishing. All right, so it's gonna be saying tap, 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 tap. Or saying squish, 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 squish. Okay, here we go. ignore the tapping and just answer a few questions for me okay just let the tapping fade into the background all right i want you to tell me if i am whispering or softly speaking very good and how about now good Did the tapping stop or is it still going? Good. Good, 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 good. All right. I want you to think of the prettiest thing that you've seen all day. It can be anything at all. Beauty is subjective. All right. Now, I want you to pick a color that represents that thing. Think of a place that starts with the first letter of that color. You got it? Good. Now I want you to think of a place that is smaller than the place that you just thought of. Think, 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 think of a place that is smaller than the place you just thought of. Good. 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 Okay. Now, I want you to think of a number between 1 and 10. Okay? Alright. So, let me see something here first. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 7, 8, 9, 10. Okay, perfect. Alright. So, have you gotten the number yet? Perfect. Okay, so whatever number you picked is something on this little charm necklace that I'm holding. And don't worry, I'll describe them to you. You don't have to open your eyes for this. So, number one is a little bottle of strawberry milk. Strawberry, strawberry, strawberry milk. Number two is a pink bunny rabbit. A pink, 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 pink bunny rabbit. 
Number three is a yellow tab for a can. Number four is a classic die, a D6. It's blue and really pretty. Number five is a little figurine of a baby, a naked baby, with a skull and crossbones on its belly. Number six is a little cup of boba, a little cup of boba tea. Number seven is a little pink mushroom. Number eight is a strawberry. Number nine is a little bottle of peach milk. Yum! And number ten is the chain that holds it all together. Which one did you pick? Okay, so let's do a thing then. So, for if you picked the one that went with the strawberry milk, I want you to tell me what your favorite flavor is or the best flavor that you've tasted this week. Either or, whatever is easiest. That's not the one that you got. If it doesn't correspond to the number that you picked, you can play along. Or if you'd like to play the game, being that you only answer the one that corresponds to your number, that's good too. Okay. And if you got the bunny rabbit, I want you to tell me what you would name a parrot if you had a pet parrot, and if you already have a pet parrot, then just what would you name a new pet parrot? All right. Do you know what? I think it'll be fun if I give a question to that corresponds with the number and then a thing for if it doesn't correspond with the number for you to think of, because then you're getting to do a thing every time. Does that make sense? It'll make sense in a sec. Let's start over and I'll show you. So, strawberry milk, favorite flavor or best flavor that you've tasted all week. If you didn't choose the number that corresponds with strawberry milk, then I want you to tell me if you could only eat one meal for the rest of your life, what would it be? All right. If you chose the one that corresponds with the bunny rabbit, then I want you to tell me what you would name a pet parrot. And if you didn't get the one that corresponds with the bunny rabbit, I want you to tell me if you were to dress like a bunny for Halloween, how would you go about that? Would it be like a big old bunny suit? Would it be more like Legally Blonde Playboy Bunny? What would it be? If you got the number that corresponds with the little yellow can tab, I want you to tell me what your favorite canned food or drink is. And if you didn't get the number that corresponds with the yellow can tab, I want you to tell me one thing you can't do that you want to, that you wish you could do. What is something that you would like to do? Okay, if you chose the number that corresponds with the D6, the little die, I want you to tell me what class you would play in Dungeons and Dragons. If you don't know any classes, I'll throw out a few for you. You could be a sorcerer, a cleric, a paladin, a rogue, 
a wizard, a barbarian, a bard. What else? What else? What else? Those are it. Let's just stop there because I don't want to overwhelm you if you don't know D and D classes. So, what class would you be? And if you didn't get the one with the D six, I want you to tell me what little figurine do you normally pick in Monopoly? I feel like they've changed now. It used to be like a little boot, a little dog, a car, a thimble, a shoe. Bless you. <laughs> okay, anyway, um, if you chose the number that corresponds with the naked baby, <laughs> I want you to tell me what you would name a baby if you wanted it to get bullied for the rest of its life and if you didn't get the number that corresponds with the naked baby i want you to tell me what you would name a baby if you wanted people to just think this is the most ridiculous motherfucker out there for the rest of their life <laughs> okay if you did the one that corresponds with the boba tea I want you to tell me what your favorite flavor of tea is, whether it's boba tea or just like a hot herbal tea, what your favorite flavor of tea is. And if you didn't choose the one that corresponds with the boba tea, I want you to tell me, oh, I had a good one and I forgot it. Oh, I want you to tell me if somebody's blowing bubbles do you pop, 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 pop them with your finger? Do you try to catch them with your tongue? Do you just idly admire? What do you do when someone is blowing bubbles? If you chose the one with the pink mushroom, I want you to tell me what your favorite forest animal or plant is. And if you didn't choose the one that corresponds with the mushroom, I want you to tell me what your name would be if you were a little forest fairy. If you chose the one that went with the strawberry, I want you to tell me what your favorite fruit flavored thing is. And if you didn't choose the one that went with the strawberry, I want you to tell me what your least favorite fruit is. And if you chose the one that went with the little peach drink, I want you to tell me what your favorite activity is to do at the beach. And if you've never been to the beach, what would you like to do? And if you didn't choose the one that goes with the peach uh, drink, then I want you to tell me what your favorite yogurt flavor is or frozen yogurt works as well and if you chose the chain that holds it all together i want you to tell me one thing that you feel holds you together and if you didn't choose the chain that holds it all together i want you to Tell me your favorite thing that comes in a group. So that can literally be like a litter of kittens or a pack of beer, like whatever it is, your favorite thing that comes in a group. All right. Good. Okay, that was a long one, but I feel like that was really fun. All right, now I just want you to pay attention to the sound of the chain. And tell me when it goes away, whether that be that it goes far away, like this, or whether that be that it just stops. Okay. Good, 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 good.
Good, 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 good. Good job. You are doing fantastic. I want you to tell me a thing that is blue. Good. Now I want you to tell me something that crinkles. Good. Now tell me something that squeaks. Now I want you to tell me something really big that starts with the letter L. That starts with the letter L. Good. Now I want you to tell me something really small that starts with the letter S. Now, just listen to the tapping. And when it stops, I want you to tell me what your favorite game of all time is, whether it's a video game or a board game. If you could only pick one. Now, when the tapping stops, I want you to find a way to tell me without telling me. Tell me without telling me. What was the last game that you played? Again, it could be a board game, a video game, sports, whatever. Tell me without telling me. What is the last game you played? Before we go, I want to play the game where I count down and you tell me when you stopped being able to hear me, okay? Here we go. Twenty. Nineteen. Eighteen. Seventeen. Sixteen. Fifteen. Fourteen. something like really envision it as best as you can envision in your mind something that you would like to dream of even if you don't dream even if you've never dreamt of this before i want you to envision in your mind picture it even if it's just like a quick little vignette I want you to envision what you would like to dream about tonight, 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 
Do you have it? All right. Hold on to it as long as you can while we close this video out, okay? I'm just going to count you down and you hold on to that image for as long as you can, okay? Ten. Nine. Eight. Seven. Three. 